welcome to the museum at Campbell River. We were pleased last year to have won the award, and what it's meant to us since then in terms of our highlights is we have partnered with the Campbell River Creative Industries Council and River Court to host a world-class digital art exhibit that will be opening this fall, opening September 2nd. We have also been able to attract several corporate sponsors, and we have been awarded three project grants that enables us to increase our access and our interpretation. What did winning the award mean to us? Well, it meant it gave validation to our staff, to our volunteers, to our board of directors of what we do is making a difference in our community and was valued. So I think that was important. Then another thing I would like people to know about the museum at Campbell River that they might not otherwise know is that we are a designated world-class international museum. That's quite an honor. It's the gold star standard of museums. Since winning the award last year, some of the highlights that our business has had continued success in is, I think, meeting our financial goals. It has been amazing, not only the corporate support that has come through, but project grants that have come through, and hosting a world-class international digit art exhibit that's opening this fall. So I think there's a strong tie-in with that award that is continuing to this day and into the future. Did I have a lemonade stand growing up, or what was my first business? That's an interesting question, because I grew up in a farm in a country school, but I did learn the entrepreneurial spirit by creating what you didn't have, whether that was a drama club in high school, or whether that was a farm market at the farm gate. So I think lemonade stands can come in many forms. Interestingly, I think the top three things about the museum at Campbell River are, it's not boring. Uh, often people will say, I don't want to go to another museum, whether it's children or older people, but they come and they say, thanks for taking me. It was amazing. The other thing is, it's touchable and doable and interactive. You don't just look through dusty display cases. Really, you really should try it. And the third thing is, it's a living history museum. History isn't in the past, it's what's happening today that informs the future. So I think all those three things are what makes us a gem on Vancouver Island. As a past award nominee winner and other nominations, I know it's important not to feel like a loser. I think it's mainly important to feel like a winner even just by being nominated. The caliber of nominees has gone way up, the media coverage you get is worth it in itself, and it's value in the community and in the business community as well as in the not-for-profit community. So celebrate your successes, small or big. And finally, why did Campbell River uh, or why did we choose Campbell River as our place to do business? Actually, Campbell River chose us because it's through the past generations, the current generations, and the future generations who have shared their stories and history with us that enables us to be who we are.